out in the trail. Just heading into the wild. Just entered the Glen Feshi estate. The darling of Scottish rewilding projects. <clears throat> Been aggressively shooting deer with snipers from a helicopter. And boy, is it looking nice. Look, tree sapling. Deer would have got that. 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 Now they're dead. That's good. Not seen any ghosts or monsters yet, which is good. But you never know. I've only been out in the trail five minutes. That's my water source for the next 24 hours. The Feshi. Big river. Path kind of has a large cliff on it. It's a beautiful fashy. I'm going down there and crossing over those boulders. Picking up the track kind of Ooh, on my finger. Okay. Quite a kind of inviting swimming pool if you like that kind of thing. I guess I probably do. Uh, I'm not gonna swim because it's like, you know, it's the morning. I'm not even had lunch yet and not at my camp, but maybe in several hours if I find something similar. Wouldn't want to rule it out. One guy that shoots the deer on this estate, he's got 25,000 confirmed kills. Unbelievable. And everywhere you look, juvenile trees popping up of all different sorts. And then over that side, different estate, barren basin, or commercial forest. It's crazy. And then you look this side, and it's boom. And it's this. Like, paradise. Jet boil is bubbling. Well, it's not bubbling yet. There's my bag. Lunchtime. And I have a little pork with pasta. And some black coffee. Mmm. Delicious. Pretty nice here. Yellow stuff. White stuff, a lot of green stuff, some purple stuff. I think Golden Eagle. small fail you may notice only one sock I jumped over what, what I thought was a kind of puddle turned out it was a very deep bog and went up to my knee in in, uh, in bog basically the most disgusting thing ever like a black slime Where did that come from? Oh. On a bridge. I haven't seen a bridge in a while. Just having a casual hot chocolate. I've not seen anyone in a while. Like ages. Just on this kind of I don't know what you call it. Probably
probably not a step. PP, but I'd be inclined to call it a step. A high plateau, a moor. Let's go with moor. Tent set up. There's my spot. There's a fence there. Not many fences in this in this neck of the woods, but this seems to be a national trust enclave, a deer fence that's trying to regrow a bit of forest. So it's a deer fence. Chowing down on some beef and potato. Morning. Five AM. Good sleep. Slept from about nine. It's me. Just kind of tucked it up because it just it was flapping. About nine to about now. Bit tossy turny. A few breaks, but nothing major. Sun's coming up. Tea's hot. I kind of vaguely wash my face. Brush my teeth. 5.30ish in the morning now. It is cold actually. My mountain weather forecast through the satellite device says feels like zero. I say it does feel like zero. <clears throat> Not a bad place to stop for breakfast. Got the jet boil on the go for some delicious coconut porridge thing. This is White Bridge. Strange name. It's red. You may note that compared to Glen Feshi, it's essentially a desert. A few old trees, but basically a barren wasteland. Exhibit A. <sighs> Sheep. The enemy. First rule of rewilding, take the sheep off the land. Another rewilding project. Big, uh, Big cattle grid down there. And deer management signs up everywhere. And look at all the baby trees. Isn't that epic? Look at them. Little Scots pine there, little something there, older, not sure. Look all over there. End of the road. Let's make the rendezvous. Just waiting for my wife. in about 15 minutes so say goodbye to the trail maybe do some stretching that's it it's all over back to roads and bins I've seen a bin in a while since yesterday all good trail over Brett Packer out